So again, it's night time. The day got away from me. Time flies. So anyway, a fella told me about this track out here. It's uh, sort of in a bit of a gap in where there's some bush between suburban sprawl. He said there's a bit of a track for four wheel driving, but he said there's a, 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 a dumped car in there to, for me to pick up. So I said I'll come and clean this up. And he's, he did mention that he said this place was a bit of a dumping ground for builders and that. But um, now that I'm here, let me just show you. It's dark, so bear with me. But look, it's just. Sorry, there's a bug flying away, flying around there. Yeah, it's on my screen, on my camera. Yeah, there's just. There's lounges and just. Look. It's unreal. This is absolutely unreal. There's all sorts of rubbish in here. Everywhere. My truck's up the top there, up the hill there, but just everywhere you look, the further you look, I can't see there's something down there as well that there's just you can't see it in the camera in the light, but you know there's just there's trash here, you can see all these little white bits here. There's just so much trash. This is just it's like the local rubbish dump. It's unbelievable how much stuff is here. Just everywhere there's, and he's right, it's builder's stuff mostly, but there's lounges and you know, tires and stuff. Here's the car, what's left of it. Let's have a look at that quickly. Who knows what this was, some sort of little hatchback of some sort, but I don't know. So I might be able to recognise the body lines of that, but may as well be a filing cabinet at this point in time. It's that rusted and stuffed up, but just the rubbish in here. People are freaking disgraceful. Look, it's not far from road. There's cars going past right there. But there's just so much trash. There's mattresses down there and lounges and just household junk. Like this is all someone's green waste, you know, someone's cut down some trees and brought that out here and dumped it. This is just the start of the track, you know, like. I mean, I can see there's a mattress up there, you know, it just keeps on going. This is disgraceful. Look, like milk bottles, like put that stuff in your, this is all just stuff from your people's bin. Unbelievable. People are disgraceful. There's all this polystyrene foam here and, I mean, what the hell do I even do about all this? This is absolutely disgraceful. You know, and the trouble is, our mate tells me it's a four-wheel driving track up through here. And yeah, that's cool. And it's probably, it probably, well, it's, it's marked on a map as a road. So it's just an un, undeveloped road. So, you know, it's probably fine. Four-wheel drivers, you know, going up the track there, that's no dramas, but but they're the ones that are gonna, you know, they're gonna suffer if, I mean, if I report this sort of stuff, council just gonna, you know, put up a big fence and then four-wheel drivers can't use it. But this is disgraceful. What do you do about this? Let me know in the comments what do you reckon I should do about all this? But I certainly can't go picking all this up. It'll take me weeks. I haven't got the, I haven't got the, machine or facility to pick this stuff up. That guy's definitely not going to help me pick it up. He won't even catch a ball. Anyway, I'll do my bit. I'll take that car. I've got the ability to carry that out. I'll probably take a couple of these wheels and any other bits of metal that I can throw in. But uh, there's so many wheels. But yeah, wow, well, pretty sad. This is people, people, damn people, disgraceful. 
Alright, anyway, I'll get into it. Let's have a look. If it's going to be easy to, it's probably just going to be easy to flip it onto the tra trailer. Generally is. So yeah, I'll do that. Right, I'm going to try my luck here and see if the. I'm going to see if the back of the car here will just sit up onto the edge of the tray and um and allow me to flip it straight over using that see how we go bit of fun oh look at that's flipping straight up it's going to tip sideways don't tip sideways on me what a bastard <laughs> oh well <laughs> i'll try something else all right just for the fun of it i'll straighten it up and we'll have a go another go of that let's see if this works see so how we go I probably need to drive forward a bit actually, it's probably it's probably hooking on the ground here. I might just drive forward a smidge to see if that works. Alright, it's sort of coming. We'll see how we go. Here we go. There it goes. <laughs> ah, that's cool. This trailer's on a bit of a slope though, you want you to probably the car might fall on its side here. <laughs> oh, all that soot inside it. Soot leaves and probably rats' nests in there. Ugh. <laughs> Here we go. That's good. <laughs> Love it. <laughs> yeah. Oh, look at all that soot. All that dust and crap. That's it. <laughs> yeah, that'll about do it. All right. That was nice and easy in the end. <laughs> Bit of fun. I'll uh, get this winch off it, strap it down, and might wait for this dust to clear. It's a bit smelly. I've had enough soot recently from the recent one, hopefully, you've seen that video. But uh, yeah, we'll get a couple of straps on it, throw some other bits and pieces, wheels, and whatever I can find laying around that I can clean up, and I'll get out of here. Right, eh? so we're strapped down. Oh, I just got to put these couple of things away. I've thrown a few, few extra things in the back of the truck. Other bits of metal that I can dump off along with this thing, wheels and whatnot. So um, yeah, no, I better tuck that uh, brake line in so that's not dangling out the side. Apart from that, that's that. I'll see you shortly at the uh, recycling yard. Yeah. Oh yeah. Yeah, straight through it. Yeah. One less pile of mess in the, out in the bush. Straight in to recycle it. Beautiful. Boys do a good job here. Yeah.